Galatians chapter 4. You're going to see it in 1 and 2. Galatians chapter 4. So let's read together. I want to go. One to go. Now I say that the heir, as long as he is a child, does not differ at all from a slave, though he is a master of all. Hold on there. So you see what the scripture says, right? Now I say that the hair, hair here is not the hair on your head. Hair here is not H A I R, it's H E I R. That means the inheritor. That means your father is a governor. Well, let's not use God. No, governors don't really inherit anything, but still it was money. Let's use like a king, a queen, queen of England. You know, the next person is going to be a king or a queen has to come from their family, right? They inherit this thing. Inheritance. I'm using that one so that everybody can understand. But if you're not Americanized or <laughs> and you're, if you have like all those clans like where I come from, then you will understand it without much explanation. So, or you can also understand it by saying your father is very rich or your parents are very rich. When they pass on to glory, right, what happens? They probably write the will and you're going to inherit something. So, he says, now I say that the hair, the, the child, my child, the one who owns what I have, as long as he is a child, does not differ from a slave. Because at that point, he can't inherit anything. What does he know that he wants to inherit? He, does, he doesn't know. He doesn't know. How, oh, exactly. That's, that's the next step. The first step is that he doesn't know that he has anything to inherit. He's like a Christian who's a Christian but doesn't know his right. So he doesn't know what to inherit. See the problem with being a Christian and not having the word of God in you? Because you don't know what to inherit. That's why Christians are still beggarly and sick because they don't know what to inherit. Christians are still beggarly because they don't know what to inherit. So you see a child remains a child because he doesn't know what to inherit. As long as he's a child does not differ at all from a slave. Because a slave doesn't have an inheritance. He only has he only has what he's being paid for his job. But a son don't have to work for what he's going to inherit. But the child is just like a slave because he doesn't even know that his father has anything to inherit. And even if they just bestow it upon him at that point, he's going to waste it. He's not going to still differ from the slave. You are the light of the world. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Join us for our reality meeting every Thursday at 7 p.m. and every Sunday at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time at 6 Cedar Street, Hampstead, New York, 11550. For prayer and counseling, call area code 516-765-765. 0323. You can also join us and follow us live on facebook.com forward slash reality meeting or subscribe and watch us live by searching for reality meeting on YouTube.